Hey everybody, the Bong is here ready to give you a brand new Let's Play! Jackie Chan's Action Kung Fu for the NES. I remember streaming this game before and I actually found it a lot of fun. This game also had a TurboGrafx-16 port as well. That some might argue is better because graphically it looked impressive. But this one actually holds up on its own too. So, let's play it. Meditation flickering. I should go now. Just jump inexplicably. So yeah, you move with the D-pad, you attack with B, you jump with A. And you can get these orbs. Give you the fireballs. I think you get them by charging the B button. The frogs are really important because they actually can have health pickups in them. I don't know if the jump kick does more damage than the regular punch. Could be more reliable because it has more reach. Nah, it's about the same. Go. Oh. There you go, that's your health. You find these bells? Get them, because that's your bonus. And I can get you good stuff. Oh, well, I already fucked up. Good one. Okay, at least you can get back on the clouds. But I'm not gonna get a perfect, sadly. You get rewards based on how well you do. You got 33 of them. Okay, so you can just get an extra life that way. Oh wait, I did get an extra life still. So that's good that I still got a reward for it. In each stage, you only have one life. But each Jackie head will... I guess it's a continue. Just kick a tiger in the head. That's all you gotta do. I wonder if the Yakuza games got inspired by this one. Like, just attack a tiger in the head. We can do that now, too. Oh, watch out for the fish. At least the frogs don't do damage on contact. And you don't die when you go in the water. Oh, that's what's throwing the nunchuck, uh, helicopters. Stop that. Oh, spike pit. Oh, are you kidding me? I got hurt from touching the thing rather than the actual arrow. Cool game. Sometimes it's hard to deal with certain enemies if they're able to have these kinds of patterns that just extend their hitbox right away. Oh, now we get to the auto scroll part. Yeah, there are auto scroll sections. Sudden platforms. Make sure you get. Good movement forward before you make that jump. Because you're going to need all the momentum you can get. Oh, 
Oh, bats. Oh, if you hit the ceiling, you just go crashing down instantly. That was close. I'm gonna take the uh, upper path. Good to know I didn't get burned by it. Okay, stop scrolling when you're trying to go up. Why can I just check around in case there's another bell? Stop that. Ah, oh, damn, I took two hits in a row. Closing in on the first boss soon. In fact, there it is. You just gotta hit it in the head. While you're dodging the arms. Hold up and B to use your uh, special move. And there you go. It's out. Just like that, we're on to stage two. I forgot if there's a button that allows you to switch your move. Or maybe you just gotta find them. Oh, I remember this level. Some platforms will actually break on, under your own weight. That one? Oh, they fire Hadoukens. Oh my god! Like, you don't get enough reaction for that. Oh, if you pick up enough green orbs, that just automatically heals you. But then you lose your fireballs. <laughs> well, actually, you only get five. Special stage? See what I gotta do. Oh, I'm definitely not gonna do well now. There's too many orbs. If you can kick them off screen, that allows you to keep more of the uh, blocks in play. Oh, look at that, now we got eight lives. I don't mind when they do the earthquake attack as long as rocks are not gonna fall. Huh, good thing I took the hit, then grabbed the health. Look how happy he is. Like, he's fighting for his life. He knows he can just fall in lava and just get incinerated into ashes, but Jackie Chan does it with a smile on his face. Only when he takes a break, though. <laughs> he's got to move, though. He has determination. Alright, just going to keep myself moving. That lava be rising. I guess if we're an underground cave, it's magma now. Either way, you touch it, you're just incinerated. So don't touch it. Oh, it's going faster. Good thing there are no enemies in this stretch. I'd be bumping into a few of them. I've played this game before, so I know what kind of things to expect. Oh. 
Oh god, now we gotta deal with these enemies that drop bikes and bicycles. Yeah, you gotta attack them when they stop. What? Where did they drop from? Oh, that gives you a new attack. Stop that. Alright, tight precision platforming, let's go. That's how you do it. Oh, I just noticed that if you hit down while you're in the air, you drop instantly. It gives you some precision on where you're gonna land. But if you pull it off by accident, that could be a problem. Oh, well, I'm almost dead too. Look at this Ben K looking, uh, schmuck. Oh! Oh no, it moves! Got him. Who and I had two hits left, too. the waterfall stage. Oh no, this stage is more focused on the uh, turtles. The red ones will launch themselves at you. High in the sky platforming, let's go. Let's see if you're up to the task. that bird. And sometimes the turtles will go all the way down. Whoop. This part's not too bad. At least the music makes it enjoyable. Just make sure you're watching their patterns before you jump to them. Silky smooth so far. I think the ones that only... Okay, you don't die, but you get sent back. I think the ones that only go up and down just a little bit are the ones that are going to collapse under your own weight. I'm just going to let that bird go. Actually, I think it's only the second one. See, that's a mean trick. Whatever, I'll take the hit. Oh, I wish I didn't take that second one. Alright, riding the log. Punch birds in the beak. This is Jackie would have wanted. Terrorized by surprise fish. Oh, Kappas! I can attack you from off screen, too. Oh, the log is gone.
error. That's how you was use the fireball. You just charge it. Good hit. And it tells you how many you got left. No! I want to get that. It's off screen already! That's lame. I'm closing in on the boss real soon. Hopefully the cannonball is a good uh, weapon to use. Do that damn cano roll. Closing out the boss real soon. Where is it? You know what? Just let that Kappa go. What? Big one eyed uh, puffer fish. Where's my Fugu? <laughs> Why did I say Fugu like I was Yogi Bear? It's like, hey Fugu, you get the picnic basket, and then you put the poison in it. Get out of here, Kappa. Star? Oh, just this move. Oh, I should have just stood up and punched. Aw, oh, damn it. Oh, big frog! With wings! It has a tadpole shield. They grow fast. Hmm. Launch the bubble, please. Got it. Oh, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. Oh, we're almost at the palace. We're gonna go through like the haunted woods. Ah, damn it. Shit! That guy just gets on my nerves. God! You have to wait for it to go back. Oh, no extra help for you. dead. Well, one CC run is dead. It's not game over. We still got that many continues left. Oh, and it puts you all the way back here. That's just terrific. Now you have no special attack. Okay, I gotta get you Sir Pattern. Let's not even try to attack them when they have the, uh, the spear out. Just go for your regular attack when it's gone. Look at this skinny-ass nin- skinny-ass yeti trying to do a, uh, ninja run. the wrong spot to stand. I 
That tiger thing is the first time I fought it. Oh, there we go. There's the bell. Oh, it's the cloud again. All right, time for redemption. Oh, there we go. Messed up in a different way. Well, I should still get a continue. Because even if you miss a few, you still get enough points. Oh, that's going to give me a lot less now. If I get enough points for health, that's still good enough. Oh geez, that's still enough for an extra life. Okay, that works for me. Why does that Yeti look like a uh, one of Mr. Burns' relatives in Bard vs. the World? The abominable snow burns, remember that? Most of the memories of the North Pole are that infamous, uh, ice cave level. And hopping the icebergs. Rather than the boss itself. Our bouncy clouds. If you're holding A while you land, or on the way down, you get a really high bounce. Use that to your advantage. I know when to not do that. It gets tricky when you're all the way up there, so you can't... Oh, damn. You can't see where you are. Oh, nice, I was able to clear it. Them quills don't feel good. That's okay, I might get three orbs. Are you kidding me? Where does that send you? Oh, do you take damage when that happens? And then you have to do it all again. Yeah, it looks like it's back at the beginning of the whole thing. Yo, that kind of bites. Oh, so I have to be really precise with my movements. Well, at least the frog with the food respawns. So I guess if you're doing poorly, you could just fail on purpose. And then you could just get the food again. There might be some strategy to it all. Although it would be better to just clear it the first time. I don't want to see if there's a reason to land on that platform. for its eye to open. Hey, you want a Visine? When you see like a purple thing with like a large hand coming at you, reminds me of that Shinobi 3 boss. Oh, its eye is really red. Now it's blind. We did it. I think this is the last level. There's 
So close. I can taste it. Oh no, I can't see. Oh, I kept missing! Oh, this enemy is the only thing that's giving me light. Oh, there's no pits. Bats have the same pattern. Okay, no, they don't. That's why they both have to go. Okay, it always is in a V. I that helps at least. It's less of a hassle to deal with. It looks like a demon head with a boot. Maybe it's an Australian demon, I don't know. go right over me. Okay, it worked. Oh, I would like to get a weapon. This one will have to do. Looks like a punt kick. Maybe I'm gonna give that a final boss dust boot. Give it the old Australia special. Jackie Chan wears a giant boot. Comically large boot. Oh god. Now we got bouncy floors and conveyor belts. And these enemies were always there. <laughs> Oh, I don't like this. I have to make sure you don't bounce into the conveyor belts. Or into the nunchucks. Go ahead, shoot your ice shard, I don't care. Okay, looks like the conveyor belts always go right. None of them just say, ah, oh, this one goes left. Uh-oh. These are all the people that attempted this auto-scroller and failed miserably. You don't want to join them, Jackie. Up! Ah! Good to know the lava is not instant death. Apparently, glowing rats do as much damage as lava. Would have thunk it. Oh, those turtles are brave. <laughs> it's like, that's okay. It only hurts humans for one HP. So how is it gonna hurt us badly? Oh, that was the source. Ah, I should have grabbed that one. Ooh, I gotta be careful when they fire off. Otherwise I get the radioactive rings. I mean, they might be fine for a hedgehog, but not for Jackie Chan. He has limits to his powers. There's nothing chasing you, so just be patient. Thought you could stand on those pipes, but no. Oh, boss already? No. Fight enemies with foreground elements. 
fun with that. I get six more of these. Yeah, I don't think you can destroy the spike balls at all. Going up. Very slowly. <laughs> Gotta build up the drama. Oh, big dirt. It's okay, its pattern is basic. Fight the dragon again. Oh, but this time you have no extra platform. You have to count on the reach of your fit. Feet. I almost said fit. Oh, come on. Give me three more of those. Or, you know what? This works too. It's not enough for full, but I'll take it. What the hell? Okay, that pattern is also easy to avoid as well. Oh, you just heal me too. As I will make sure you're ready for the final battle. It's Wacky Chan! Okay, at least this pattern is pretty basic. Be careful because sometimes it's a high jump or a low jump. But at least the body doesn't hurt you when it's flashing. Only when it stops. No! Mulligan that shit right now! I hit you first. I was a couple hits from winning, too. So lame. Oh, you only healed me a little. I don't know what that did, because it didn't heal me. Spider Demon! Might as well just use the last of my fireballs. There, it's over. Tanked it out! came to see. And there you go, that's it! That's Jackie Chan's Action Kung Fu for the NES. Hope you all enjoyed watching it as much as I enjoyed playing it. This game is actually quite accessible in terms of difficulty. 
and it's very colorful. So this is definitely worth a try. Heck, maybe you try the Turbo Graphics version if you're able to as well. And there you go. That's that's your ending. That was pretty easy to put together because it's just this. Oh, victory music! You get to see all the areas you traveled. Thankfully, Jackie Chan did not do this with his eyes closed. <laughs> I'm sure he could have if he wanted to. But uh, yeah, like I said, give this game a try any way you can. It's definitely a good platformer. So anyway, this is the Bong is signing off, saying goodbye, Godspeed, and stay tuned for my next Let's Play. Thanks for watching, everybody, and I shall see you next time. Let's just enjoy the rest of the credits while we have them.